Dropbox is a very popular cloud storage service that is used by many people. So in this lesson, we're going to see how we can create an account for Dropbox to get started uh, with Dropbox. So for that, I'm going to open up a browser. In my case, I'm opening up Microsoft S browser, but you may open up any web browser of your choice and then type in dropbox.com just like this and press enter. So once you open up dropbox.com, you get to the landing page right over here. And here you can see that there's an option to try free for 30 days. This is for business, but what, what we're going to do is we're going to use this uh, personally. So we're going to go to or get Dropbox Basic. This is the free version right over here. Once you click on this, you can see that it opens up Basic right over here, just like that. And you can sign up to Dropbox for free. Some of the other options. So if I were to go back, you'll be able to see that there's uh, some professional standard right here for like teams and for advanced. So the, these provide more space, for example, like three terabytes and so forth. So, but to get started and for basic use, you don't need set, uh, so much of a space. So you go, you can uh, just go with the basic one. So we are just going to go to get Dropbox basic right here, which is very free. So now let's go over here and let's get started. So how do we uh, sign up for it? is by clicking on this button right here. So there's a 2 GB uh, free storage that, that we have access to with a free account right over here. So we're just going to sign up for a free account right over here. So we're going to add in the name right over here. So I'm just going to add in Twitter and I'm going to add in Tube right over here. And then I'm going to add in my email address and then I'm going to add in a password right over here just like this. So you can see the Dropbox terms and conditions right over here by clicking on this button right over here. And as you read it, you can go back and then continue with the registration right over there. So we're just going to continue right over here. So tutor tube just like this and then add in the email address and password right over here. All right. So once you agree the terms, you can just create an account or if you have a Google account, you can directly sign in with your Google account and make an account with that as well. So we are just going to continue and create an account right over here. So once we create an account just like this, uh, it'll stop. Uh, you do have to wait for a bit right over here until it processes. And now you can see that the account has been created and you can save the password as well as you can see right over here. So now uh, we can continue. It says that it gives you an offer. We don't, don't want that offer. So we, go, we are going to continue with the 2GB uh, Dropbox basic plan right over here, just like this. And now I have an option to download Dropbox and install onto the computer right over there. And however, just signing up is not enough. What you also have to do is verify your email. So just open up your email right over there and then go to your uh, inbox. So there you'll receive an email that says verify your email. So just click on this email so that your account will be verified and then it won't keep on asking you to verify the account right over there. So once you click on it, your account will be verified and you'll be able to uh, access your uh, Dropbox and start using it by entering your username and password right over here. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.